<laughs> You've seen Joker in Smash, but you have not seen you. All right, dude, what is up, everybody? Welcome to another PMEX Remix video. Today, we're going to be checking out you, Persona 4. I don't know what to expect. Persona 4 is actually my favorite Persona game, so I'm very excited about this one. Let's check it out. Guess I better not embarrass myself. Ooh, that intro, not bad. So, let's just go ahead and test overall movement. Interesting. I'd say you feels fast, but not too fast. I will say the model is hella detailed and clean, not too shabby at all. Let's test out the basics. All right, for jabs, we got one, two. So a one, two. For up tilts, we have, what the heck? I'm glowing now. This is down tilts. It's like a simple swing, like a combo starter move, not bad. Four tilt. I forget that uh, in Smash, characters just lay down until you tell them to get up. And now for dash attack. What the? Oh, no way, I pull out my persona. That is so cool, dude. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Yeah, this, guy, this is like thumbnail material almost. That's pretty clean. Oh, with Mario in the background? Wait, this I think this might be the perfect thumbnail, low-key. Dang, overall, really positive impressions so far. Let's keep checking out more of the moveset. Like, you can just see you in the background. He's just clapping. <laughs> just clapping. All right, I'm hanging out with my boy Joker. And uh, let's test out these aerials. So for forward air... Ooh, there's a lot of power behind this one. Not bad. Up air? Ooh. So I like how he's a sword fighter, but the animation, whoa, you can literally hit them while they were on the ground. Did you see that? Let's get a replay on that bad boy. That's insane. Down air? Oh, no way, bro. Oh, this is sick. So you just kind of slam down. <laughs> nice. Back air? So it's just kind of like a backwards swipe. And then for neutral air. It kind of looks like Link's neutral air. Oh, that's such a cool animation. This is super cool. I was not expecting this level of quality. All right, that's all the aerials. Oh yeah, let's take a look at some alternate costumes. Uh, we got default here, and then we have a red and black one. Oh, that's cool. It's a Chie reference. I like that. So this got to be Yukiko. Okay. Then this is a Rise one for sure. I don't know who this one is, but this one's cool. Oh, I like this one a lot too. Blonde hair with the blue jacket. Not bad. And then back to default. So pretty good color palette. I'm liking this. If I'm gonna fight, I'm going all oh, wow. More voice lines. I like all the voice lines I have. Okay. Let's go ahead and do the specials. I feel like this is where we're going to finally discover what the glowing is all about. So for neutral B, I launch myself and do like a lunging attach. Down B. What the heck? Uh, the sound effect will not repeat itself, but that was a Persona 4 sound effect. For side B. Oh, wow. You throw out your Persona. Let's go. Izunagi. That's pretty sick. So for upbeat, it's very simple. It's just basically like another jump. Nothing crazy. However, I think... Never mind. I was going to say, I thought you got more actions after using it, but no, you don't. I genuinely don't know what that means. Maybe we'll figure it out later in gameplay. No way. I saw this mushroom gorge stage and I was like, I gotta check this out. What the heck? The middle's bouncy. I guess that's to be expected. Um, let's test out the grabs. So for down throw, just like a quick little slam down, up throw. Okay, very simple. Back throw. Not bad, not bad. And last but not least, forward throw. Wow. Okay, that's a good amount of knockback. I also want to test uh, hitting while grabbing. You just mash your knee into them nice now yes you're viewing this correctly this is blaziken i actually reviewed blaziken in rivals of ether very recently and that character was awesome they had ex moves and a ton of fancy stuff so uh, go check that out afterwards if you like blaziken wow i don't think there's no time to play games such manly energy wow there's so many voice lines we get a new one every single time so let's go ahead and uh, see if you has a final smash. That is certainly a final smash. Now, if you ask me what just happened, 
I would be unable to answer that question. I have no clue what just happened. It was cool though. Let's also test the taunt. Okay, it's just a whatever, I guess. I don't know. All right, other taunts. Oh, there's another taunt. Very nice. Side taunt. I should leave him be. Very cool. So you has three taunts, probably the most fleshed out character we've seen uh, so far, even though this is only the first episode of character reviews. We did do a generic video of me checking out this mod, so if you want to see like a wide variety or my first impressions of this mod, we did make a video of, on that recently. But yeah, pretty cool stuff. All right, it is time for smash attacks. So for Ford Smash, it's like a stun. What the heck? Oh, <laughs> the shield blocks it that Young Link has. Okay, so that's super cool. I like that a lot. Up smash. What the heck? It's a 1-2. And then down smash. I collected the smash ball on accident while doing that too. So it's like a lightning attack. Interesting. Okay, very cool. All right, thanks, Young Link. Appreciate the help. All right, now that we've officially covered the full moveset, it is time to put it to the test. Let's see how this goes. All right, I guess we're fighting Shadow by Fate. That's cool. I just wanna see what kind of combos you can get. Forward air is kind of disgusting. You know what's funny? I've been playing Rivals for so long, I thought I could wall hop after I recovered, so I gotta not do that. Oh, nice tech. I mean, it wasn't enough, but still, that was a good tech. Wait, what the heck? Okay, I think I realize what the down B does after you start glowing. It allows you to hit with your persona more than once. Because my persona added like an extra combo. Oh, uh, I guess you're allowed to hit twice normally. I don't know. Oh, that's not good. I really want to know what this down B does. It doesn't have a hitbox. Maybe if they're behind me, I should try and wait till they're behind me. No, I lined it up perfectly, dude, uh, this guy. Okay, waiting for you to go behind me, come over here. Okay, the text does not have a hitbox like I thought it would, but I think it adds to my jab because my jab normally doesn't have my persona and it had my persona, so here's my jab normally, right? Okay, now let's build up. Uh oh, Shadow, can you not do that? That'd be, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Maria, all right, Shadow, sure, man. Nice. Okay, Ford Smash is a great edge guarding because you can just use your persona off the edge. Yo, that victory screen. That was clean. Who the heck am I fighting right now? Is this Sub Zero? I feel like I'm gonna look like an idiot for saying that. They should have the character names on the HUD. That'd be kind of nice. All right, we are on a bomb bomb battlefield in Mario 64, and uh, I thought it looked cool. And yeah, I was right. This looks really cool. It was like the whole dang thing. Oh wait, that's cool. That I can use my side B in order to buy myself some space and time to recover. Okay, up here, kind of nasty. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Another dub, another dub. Let's go. Oh wait, that's another unique victory screen. That one's different. All right, it's time to battle Joker to settle who is the best main character in the Persona series. I mean, I don't know. All right, let's do this. The real deal, baby. Dude, this song is actually garbage, bro. All right, here we go. This song should be much better. And literally anything would be an improvement over what we just heard. All right, let's go. I've always liked this Fountain of Dreams. It's always been one of my most favoritely styled ones. One thing I will say, I'm just so impressed at how well polished. Oh, let's go. Now that was a stylish finisher. It would be cool if you were able to act out of it for landing it off stage, because that's like hella risky. But yeah, I was just gonna say, like, I really appreciate how well polished this character is. Some of the animations are a bit stiff. I mean, I'm not gonna say it's the greatest thing ever, but it's much better made than I was expecting, that's for sure. Oh, no way, bro. The combo game is real. I like how literally you can get like a free side, yeah. 
very cool. Oh, the edge guard. I still would love to know what my uh, down B does. There was fire that time. Has there always been fire? I don't know. You actually get a uh, knockback boost when you play as the Chie skin. I'm just kidding. That'd be funny though. Actually, it wouldn't be because that'd be so broken. Okay, I want to see if I can hit into my persona. That'd be kind of cool. Let's see. So how would I do that? Wait, what? What is that lasting hitbox? That was like nine years. All right, well, that was anticlimactic, but I guess that settles it. Persona 4, the better game, baby. Get wrecked. Persona 5 fans mauling in the comments right now. They're so mad because they just can't accept that Persona 4 is the better game. All right, now that all the Persona 5 fans have clicked off the video, let's beat up some Fire Emblem characters. Well, uh, you said it himself. So I thought we'd go to the Fire Emblem stage itself to really demonstrate just how disrespectful we are by uh, going to their own homeland and beating them up in their own territory. So, yeah, I don't know. I couldn't think of a better finale. But if you ask me, I'm pretty satisfied with this one. I think this is going to be quite nice. I mean, assuming I win. If I don't win, then it'll be very unsatisfying. But I think we'll win. I think I'm pretty confident that we're going to win this. <laughs> okay, they just beat each other up. Why is Marth stunned? What happened to him? Why is Marth holding out his shield? Marth, are you good, bro? What's going on with the Marth AI? Somebody fix that. Actually, don't fix it. It's kind of funny. I like it. Dude, uh, no, but seriously, it's a CPU. It's not even like a, my controller or anything. Why is the Marth AI just holding the shield down? I don't understand. Yep, okay, yep. Marth is just going to continuously do the same thing the entire match. That's fine. I don't mind breaking a few shields. Yo, the triple kill? That we've all been waiting for? Nice. Now that's a triple kill. Wait, did I did I fix Marth? Oh, Marth is fixed. What did I do? I don't even know what I did. Oh my gosh, that was a beautiful counter. Oh my gosh. Okay, this Marth looking a little spicy. Okay, you never know. Marth could win this. Marth could actually bring home the bacon. Or, or uh, you know, could... um. All right. Uh... Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. All right, that's going to be it for today's video. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe. I had a blast. I love Persona 4, if you couldn't already tell. It's actually my favorite Persona game, and it was one of the best things I ever streamed, too. Uh, so, a little segue, twitch.tv slash linklight. Come join the community live. I play all kinds of games, and I'm live almost every single day. If you enjoyed this video and want something a little similar, I did do a first impressions of this mod, where I checked out a few variety of characters. I think we checked out Shadow, Tails, Blaziken, and a few others go check it out and i will be making more reviews on characters in this mod in the near future all right check out some more videos on the end card and i will see you in the next video bye bye all right now that all the persona 5 fans have clicked out the <clears throat> can't speak.